all the teams this year are going to be very, very hard to beat. Um, it's going to be a very, very tight tour, I think, and consistency is probably going to be a big factor this year and just trying to clock in podium finishes at each event and then ramp it up for the end of the season. My approach has always been just to be a little bit better the day after the day before, you know. It's, it's really just about tightening up with the communication and, and the skills and, and, and everything on board just to get a little bit more accurate uh, and therefore, you know, a little bit more consistent. Team-wise, you know, I, I don't think anyone's strong, anyone's weak. Team Alpari FX being back in the tour has raised the game and uh, it's going to make it a lot harder for Williams and Bjorn and Phil. It'll probably come down to teamwork and who's got the best team at the end of the day. It's not the skipper, it's not anyone else on board, it's all working together and that's going to be a big part of it. There's a bit more pressure as one of the tour card holders this year, but you know we're sailing with the same team, kind of doing the same thing. So we're just going to again take it one race at a time, and I think we've definitely raised some eyebrows. But you know we're not going to change anything on our part. So I don't know. I'm just going to treat every race as I uh, always do. I want to go out there and win. We've won the last two Alpari World Match Racing Tours. Uh, of course, we wouldn't be happy in, unless we win another. It's not to say it'll be easy, but uh, that's got to be our goal, and that's what we'll be trying to do. I think it's always nice to beat the other Kiwi team, that's for sure, so we'll put a target on Monoprio's head and try and take him out. We're going to do what we've got to do to win, mate.